So Motorola Zoom, so it runs um, Android 3.0, um, Honeycomb software. Software has been uh, designed and optimized for uh, the tablet format. Also, the Google apps have been optimized for the tablet format, so you, you'll see a few differences there. Uh, in terms of hardware, uh, we have a dual-core processor, one gig of RAM, and 32 gig of internal memory. Uh, it's a 10.1 inch HD display. Um, we have two cameras, so we have a camera at the back, five megapixel with flash, and a front-facing camera for uh, webcam for uh, video chat. Um, no physical uh, controls, so all your controls are down here, uh, which gives it a, quite a sleek and, and modern uh, look. Um, the only sort of hard keys are the volume keys here and the power button at the back. Um, so if I take you through um, what it looks like, so uh, it's got five home panels. Obviously you can customize these as you wish, a uh, number of widgets and application shortcuts. Um, some of the uh, widget shortcuts are quite interesting uh, in how, how they've been designed by Google. So unfortunately I've only got one email here, but uh, it's a scrollable widget, so you get a preview of your email right on your home screen before you even app open the application. Um, great browsing experience on here, uh, obviously with the dual core processor and the one gig of RAM, pages load really quickly. Um, you've got multi it supports multi-tab browsing, which is new for tablets. Um, it has a nice little uh, feature here, the uh, incognito tab, which means it doesn't record your search history, which is kind of quite nice. Um, uh, browsing. Sorry, what's the uh, communication mechanism? Is it more than Wi-Fi? Or? So, yeah, I mean, here we're using over Wi-Fi, yeah. But it also has a cellular radio in it as well. Uh, yeah, so um, what's the, the version coming to Europe? Does it have a 3G or 4G connection, or is it only Wi-Fi? Uh, I think it's... Well, we're running this on Wi-Fi. 